wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the nine best KVM switches. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 9, the Ugreen 50280 receives video through a VGA cable and delivers commands via USB using a Type-B connector. It maxes out at a 1080p resolution at 60Hz and works well with most operating systems. It's pretty affordable for a 4-way device. It comes with three USB inputs, but there's no audio pass-through and it doesn't have an HDMI output. At number 8, the CK Lao 64HUA is especially easy to use thanks to soft touch buttons on the front panel and a reliable on-off rocker switch on the rear. It sends signals to the individual computers via a USB cable and lets you access the system's microphones as well as stereo outputs. It's equipped with a customizable hotkey and a front-mounted USB 2 slot. However, the rear input ports are unreliable. Coming in at number 7 on our list, not only is the Gitec CKL41UA one of the most dependable options, it also costs very little for something that lets you control four PCs from a single set of input devices. It has ports on the side specifically for a keyboard and mouse, and one for attaching a USB hub. It's fully bus powered, but it does require a monitor with a VGA port, and its cable management is poor. Our newest choices can only be seen at Wiki. Dot .easybit.com Go there now and search for KVM switches or simply click beneath this video. At number 6, unlike some, the TrendNet TK215i features a stereo audio pass-through in addition to a physical toggle switch on a 5-foot tether. It draws electricity directly from the connected computer's USB ports, so it doesn't need an external power source. It connects to speaker and mic jacks and comes with fully integrated cables. However, it is costly for a two-way unit. Moving up our list to number 5. Available with 8 or 16 ports, the TNP rack mount is designed to allow IT professionals access to individual server units with the push of a button. It uses the common VGA format connectors and is compatible with most popular operating systems. It transmits at up to 250 MHz and includes a remote control. It fits in a typical 1U slot. At number 4, there are multiple reasons why the TE Smart 0201 is ideal for consumers looking to streamline their computing and home theatre experiences. It's compliant with HDCP 2.2, capable of transmitting Dolby Vision and HDR10 metadata, and compatible with both Windows and Mac OS. It comes in a durable metal casing with an integrated mounting bracket and an onboard stereo audio connector. Gearing the top of our list at number 3. If all you need is a two-way device to control a pair of side-by-side -side PCs, the Ugreen 2-in-1 should have you covered. It's compact, quite inexpensive, and shows a high rate of customer satisfaction thanks to its reliability and effectiveness. It promises a plug-and-play installation and doesn't require a power supply. It's good for resolutions up to 1920 by 1440 Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easybit.com. Go there now and search for KVM switches, or simply click beneath this video. At number 2, while the ESDS 4K is a touch pricey for such a simple model, it's also one of the most reliable and can accommodate nearly any operating system. It's one of the rare ones that has two USB ports on the front in addition to the dedicated mouse and keyboard connectors. It switches between PCs quickly and also comes in an 8-port version. It offers a hotkey or push-button operation and taking the top spot on our list. As one of the few that works with Ultra HD resolutions at 60 Hz, the TE Smart HKS0401 is among the most capable models released to date. It has two ports for input devices and a single switched USB jack for use with an additional peripheral. It features full 444 chroma sampling, EDID emulation on all inputs, and 10-bit color. Our newest choices can only be seen at Wiki, .easybit.com. Go there now and search for KVM switches or simply click beneath this video.